What if Enceladus orbited the Earth? So, following our recent Europa around Earth and Venus video, we're going to try out Enceladus this time around. Now, in Universe Sandbox, Enceladus also has a very, very high albedo, meaning it reflects quite a lot of light. I believe it was about 81% actually Enceladus in uh, Universe Sandbox. So we're going to see if that makes a difference or not around the orbit of Earth. So there we go, that is Enceladus placed in orbit of Earth. There it is, looking very, very good as always. So we're going to go ahead and see, if we speed up some time, Will Enceladus melt or will it stay frozen? Remember, in Uranus Sandbox, it doesn't have an atmosphere. It's very highly reflective. Let's go ahead and see. So let's speed up time. And here we go. So long, long time. Also, we're orbiting around the sun very fast with Enceladus here. As we can see, it's warming up. Okay, we've got lots of simulation time. And it's just staying stuck at minus 85.9.8. It's not changing at all. So, and that is with. I mean, we're running hundreds of years here at this point. So Enceladus, like Europa, it just doesn't have the temperature to warm up in Universe Sandbox. So it's highly reflective. Obviously, the ice won't melt or lower the albedo. So I did see some people commenting about that. But yeah, this on this occasion, in this uh, circumstance, Universe Sandbox does not have the uh, capabilities to you know, lower albedo by itself. But, you know, we will lower the albedo manually. So it's currently on 81%, as I said. I'm going to lower it down. I'm going to put it to about 14%. Let's see if that makes a difference with Enceladus. So there we go. Again, let's run up, speed up the time, and immediately we can see it's now in the positive temperatures. So if we go ahead and pause, zoom into it, it's currently sitting at a very stable 12 degrees by the looks of things. So again, let's continue running it up. And as you can see, going up to 15, 16. So it all depends on the albedo gauge. I've lowered that manually. As in, um, I know some people were saying eventually that ice on Europa probably would melt. So as we can see here, sitting at a uh, 24, 25 and continually warming. So Enceladus has got a nice small ocean on it now. And there it is, looking pretty good.